Hey YouTube, what's up? It's me, Ian, here with Atkins Nature Aquariums. And I got a box. What's in the box, you say? Well, let's find out. I already opened it, so we don't gotta mess with any of that mambo jamo. Got my West African cichlid tank next to us. That's probably super loud and in the way of everything. All right. Citric acid. This will all make sense in a minute. Baking soda. Then I got this little box. So this little box is not the main thing. It's part of the main thing. But there's another box. And that's a timer. That's had that that it's part of what everything is if you can take a guess take a guess now I tried to order everything in one box but it did not show up in one box and this is a DIY CO2 generator system. So I'll be doing a more uh, install video later and pretty much what it is and how it works. But it's pretty much a pressurized DIY CO2. One of the boxes. Oh, came undone here. Alright, this looks like all the small stuff. Comes with a measuring cup and a funnel, which is handy. This can be reused. I like that. Oh. A glass CO2 diffuser and a glass YouTube U connector. And it's got a suction cup in there. So pretty much this is an upgrade from my sugar and yeast CO2 system. Some CO2 proof tubing. Oh, and this company is F-Zone. Lots of boxes. There's an O-ring seal. This is a filter for the regulator so it doesn't get any of the bubbles or water into the regulator that will damage it. A bubble counter. And 
and here is the regulator it's got two gauges dual gauge one's for bottle pressure and the other is output pressure so that's pretty handy Let's see how did this go in there I think it was this way Okay, we'll put everything in the box, and so that means the last box is our bottle. Oh, this thing's heavy. So we can now get rid of that box. Wow, this is a lot bigger than what I thought it was. Wow. So here's my hand. That is a two and a half liter system. Supposedly this holds over a thousand PSI but it comes with all the instructions and everything you need to get started. Oh, and last thing, this box. This is probably the most important thing out of everything that we unboxed today when setting up a CO2 system. And that is a solenoid. And what a solenoid does is basically it controls when this CO2 system turns on and off. And it's pretty much an electronic valve right here. Ah, and it comes with a bubble counter. So I've got a spare bubble counter if I ever need one. And that's the cord that plugs into it. And this must be the brick. Fairly small, not super big and in the way. It's not like a huge clunky block. So, yeah. We got a big mess and we are going to start some new CO2 system and see how this goes and there's a cat in a box see you guys next time bye